Welcome to Battle Troop, in my point of view. I don't know you, so I'm not a hater. I could only give you the facts that's written on these papers. And since we have no dealings, therefore the court can care less about your feelings. I'm the Honorable Malachi Markilli, your presiding judge, chairman and spokesperson for the One United Front. You are my witnesses and jury. You may be seated. Court is now in session. Let's talk about it. Okay, man. Looking back on the face off, what took place, man, because I didn't see him when they uh, actually took place on uh, a night, just the night before the battle. Um, but when I went back and looked at it, man, a couple things was revealed to me in ARP uh, uh, tactics in landing these battles, man. These brothers began to unlock things that they didn't know about. And it's the Bible say one man's story sound like the truth until the next person speaks. And you know what's crazy? That's exactly what happened here. These brothers were told two different things only to come together and find out who was the source, the monkey in the middle that was actually landing these things. One of them say, I didn't ask for you. Oh, you asked for me. No, you asked for me. Come to find out. This is what was just set up just to get these brothers to get on the platform and battle. But here's the thing, though. Kayshawn was speaking and was saying how ARP tried to play him in so many ways by saying, by getting him to agree to a certain number for a battle, only to not tell him who his opponent would be. We know in battle rap, that, that, that means a lot to some people. Determining, look, the level of opponent you have determines, depending on who that opponent is, how much more money you get. That's a fact. That's a fact for some people. Mook was talking about his pay never changed because by him being the number one dude in the game, it don't matter who he battled. His pay don't change. He was addressing Tsunami Surf on this when Surf was uh at uh when Surf was saying if he ain't going to battle Mook, he got to get uh more money. He not gonna accept the same pay he been uh getting if he ain't going to battle Mook. And Mook was like, URL had his money, what he asked for, but the problem was Surf. Surf demanded more money, seeing that he was going to be battling him. So, that's the same for a lot of people. That's the same thing uh, Luck said to Hollow in the battle that you dug book. He said, I've given you the most money you ever been given for a match. Don't even thank me for that. Because he got at least half of what Lux got for the battle. You know what I'm saying? You remember uh, Arsenal and uh, um, Hollow had that uh, that misunderstanding due to that. When Hollow was like, you didn't even pay me. I got paid through somebody else. And Arsenal was like, no, I paid you that money. I just didn't put in my name because you would have did such and such. Well, ARP been called out on some of his business tactics. And this is what K-Shine said. K-Shine said, you tried to get him to agree to a number but wouldn't let him know who his opponent was, trying to get over on him, trying to get him to agree to something without knowing that he's going up against, for the most part, a legend, a legend in the game before we knew Jay Mill was going to think the place up. So you had him try to agree to a number without telling him who he was going up against. You know what I'm saying? And then when he found out it was Jay Mills, he was going up against, he told you like, oh man, huh? how you going to do that? And you're like, no, 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 you said you were battling for this much. Come on, man. Come on, man. Why would you use them tactics? Why not just tell the bird, hey, I got Jay Mill for you, you know what I'm saying, such and such. Why would you have this man try to agree to something that you, you know you're getting over? You know that out the gate. Even your approach, even it, even your approach is conniving. Even your approach is manipulative. Even the whole setup of how you did that with them brothers, man. And they just called you out on it. You've been getting called out on a lot of stuff lately, fam. And it's like you're starting to mess up what people have known you to be. What they gave you respect for, being an upright stand-up dude who handled business real well. The daylight situation, they exposed you on that. The um, 
the the uh, the murder mook event. You got exposed on that. And now this one right here. You get what I'm saying? Now this right here with K Shine and the Jay Mill situation. Like, come on, what what is it, fam? The thing I be trying to get you brothers to understand is you don't have to do that. You don't have to do that. Just be honest out the gate and tell a person what it is. You tell a person what it is, you'd be surprised at just how far you can get telling the truth and just being honest. So we're going to say you appear to be a stand-up, upright, honest brother. But all you got to do is tell the truth, man. Y'all ain't got to manipulate these brothers or, and, and, and try to uh, cut corners and cut costs by not being honest and genuine. Just tell the truth. Just tell the truth. I remember when I was in a dope game and my shipment would be coming in. And when my shipment would be coming in, when I first started getting it, it would be in brick and then it would have a lot of shake at the bottom. A lot of people don't know what shake is. Shake is like the residue, you know what I'm saying? But usually shake is mixed. I used to like getting mine in a brick. I didn't like my stuff. I ain't like no shake. I liked it all my stuff in brick. But when I first started getting it, I didn't understand it like that. So when you put it on a scale, you know the shake make up the grams <coughs> or the ounces. Whatever, whatever, whatever it is, the shake make up the total uh, number of what you're supposed to be getting. And what happened was when I get to cooking that stuff up, whipping it up, put it on a scale, it don't come back. So what I started doing when the work had come, I take the brick out, sit that to the side, then I weigh the shake up. See how much the shake is. Then when I would cook the work and it all, and what it didn't come back as was the amount of shake that was in there. I'm like, oh, he put like two ounces of shake up in there. So it's like off like that. So call, hey man, that didn't come back right. Oh, what you mean it didn't come back right? But you but I'm thinking <coughs> I'm thinking I'm getting a deal. I'm thinking I'm getting a deal in the dope and getting it at a fair price. When in reality, I'm not. Because what he knocking off, he replacing in shake. You get what I'm saying? I'd rather for you to just sell it to me the price that it is. Don't make me think I'm getting a deal when you still when you plan me. That's the same thing. Trying to get them brothers to agree to something by giving them a big battle that they know they supposed to be getting paid more for. K Shine put you out there like that on there, and he would write right so in doing so. You get what I'm saying? That kind of shifty though, fam. Just be honest with them brothers, man. Y'all ain't got you, you know what's crazy? You don't y'all don't have to do that. Like smack them, right? They they steady promoting Hollow and John John. Hollow and John John. Just drop the new trailer. Hollow and John John going down November 10th. You ain't got to say that. Just be honest. Look, the battle ain't going down, man. We're gonna take it. You know what I'm saying, man? Just be honest and do good business. Do good business. Stop trying to manipulate brothers and things like that, man. You know, y'all don't have to do that, man. Just be honest, man. Just do honest and do fair business. Let me tell you something. Money going to be there regardless. That's the one thing y'all have to understand. The money going to be there regardless. Just be patient and loyal. Be patient and loyal, man. Don't try to rush things so quick by stepping on toes and burning bridges and doing people wrong while you on your way to the top. You don't have to do that. Just be patient. Let patient have a perfect work. Keep a reputation of being a loyal stand-up dude, man. Because just saying it and it's not true, going to always expose you for not being what people honored you for. You understand what I'm saying? You don't have to do that. You know what I'm saying? Should have told that brother out the gate.
I got Jay Mills lined up for you, man. I could give you that much. If he didn't like it, then you negotiate. But don't call that brother up like he said you did. Like, hey, what's going on? You going to get on the card? I got a battle lined up for you. How much you going to charge me to get on the card? Oh, yeah, I charge you. Just give me like four or five. I'll do it for you. Okay, bet. Then you bring out a superstar. You going up against Jay Mills. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Don't set me up like that. Don't make me thinking you calling me to help you out, to do you a favor, and then I'm trying to just look out for you, and then you throw this out on me. By the way, I'm giving you the legend. He coming back after 15 years, and everybody want to see him. The pay-per-view is going to be rocking, baby. No, don't play me like that. Don't give me four and give him 70. Give me four and give him 60. Come on, man. <laughs> Come on, man. No, that ain't cool. You know what I'm saying? And Kayshawn said, that's how you tried to play him, fam. And then you heard Jay Mills. Hey, then Jay Mills called you out on it, too. Jay Mills like, man, man, keep it real. Keep it a buck. Or I get up and leave from here. I get up and leave from here right now. Oh, no, 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 no. He got scared. Hey, I got scared. He said, no, 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 no. Both y'all telling the truth. I ain't heard neither one of y'all lie yet. But they like, okay, you telling them, son. You telling them, son. You telling them something, you telling me one thing. Am I lying? Or is he lying? So how both of them right? They both wasn't lying. But you told them two stories. <laughs> Keshai wasn't lying about him. J. Mill wasn't lying about him. But yet these brothers in disagreement of how it went down. Think about that, y'all. K ARP said K Shine wasn't lying about what he was saying. J. Mill said, I mean ARP said J. Mill wasn't lying about what he was saying, but they both in disagreement with each other about what was being said. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on, man. Do better business, bro. And this battle truth. It ain't my judgment that's in question. It's yours. ARP. Come on, fam. I'm trying to tell you, man. You find out exactly how a person really is when money get involved. I'm trying to tell you what I know. We were coming up deep like we was as a friend and family and things like that and a, and a mob and gang. We didn't really have no problem when we were poor and struggling because we all stood together, together and, we, and, and, and we were struggling together. You get what I'm saying? When money started getting involved, man, can start turning on people, snitching on people, setting people up, trying to dirty Mac you, do all that. Like, damn, fam. We, we lost so many guys. On a, on, on, on a come up of making money, sometimes I used to think like, man, we better off being broke, man. We were more unified when we was broke than when we started making money. You find out exactly how a person really is when he started getting money in his pocket. When you broke for the most part, you kind of humble. You know what I'm saying? You humble. And you need a person to help you. So you adjust. You adjust to the struggle. You adjust to your peers. You adjust to what uh, uh, life throw out there to you. But then when you start getting money, what it does is reveal to you who you really are as a person. It's okay to change. Change. And this battle truth. Change for the good. It ain't my judgment that's in question. It's yours. Be loyal. Be faithful. You'd be amazed how far you would go when you live and stand for the truth. Styrofoams and ashtrays. Hit the link in the description box. Get it if you ain't got it.